Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Muhammad Asim. I'm working at DevOps Engineer. Guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how we can create the Helm chart with a single command. And for that, what I've done, I've created a repo for you guys, and we are going to use a package called Helmify. So let's uh, do that. You need to have a Linux uh, machine or Mac, um, but I'm using Windows. So how you can do that? So what I do, I'm going to use a single container which is going to be a slim Python, right? So for Windows, what I'm going to do, simply I'm going to copy this command. And for Linux and Mac, I've shown you all the commands which are actually the same, but you know, the architecture is going to be different. For Windows, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use this Python slim container, simply type PowerShell here and right click it and simply run this guy as admin. So if you see, currently we don't have any direct directory on our desktop so i'm going to run this uh, command here in the powershell so the new directory helmify is created and it is it is actually mounted on a, a slash mnt so what i'm going to do i'm going to take a shell into that and from the docker uh, i just want to show you this is uh, helmify container is running and simply i'm going to exact into this container and if i do docker ps docker exec into this container I have a complete Linux uh, environment and I'm going to simply install um, Helmify. So we are going to install the latest version of Helmify, which is 03.22 and simply copy these commands and paste it here. So uh, we are installing um, curl along with that. This package is going to be downloaded on our uh, container and uh, you will see shortly that um, that this package is going to be uh, mounted. So let me do this command, run this command. So it seems like those are just uh, installation of curl. So let me do that again. So let's try to run this command. So you see uh, it is downloading that particular package and it is going to be available here because it is mounted on slash mnt you see uh, we have uh, downloaded the package and uh, if you see run this command help me fire dash version and we have this version uh, you need to simply navigate to this uh, github uh, repository and simply type help me fire, navigate to this uh, github section and from here if you navigate to the package releases this is the latest version click on the releases and uh, i just want to show you the link for instance i'm using the python slim so simply copy this guy uh, right click it and that's what we have done here right so that is the installation part and other command uh, i just need to show you that uh, what you need to do um, as a demo uh, what i've done i've uh, have these key directory which includes the deployment that is the sample deployment right and along with that i have a service.yml so what i'm going to do i'm going to convert these uh, complete directory yaml files into a helm chart so what i'm going to do i'm going to simply download uh, this as a zip right so uh, the advantage of using helmify is that you can uh, either go for the complete directory which uh, in which you have uh, your manifest files uh, or you can uh, simply um, convert the single file into Helm chart. So I'm going to extract here. You know, usually we have directory in which we have all the manifest uh, files. So I'm going to simply drag this guy and I'm going to move this here. So if I do ls here, right, uh, you will see that k8 directory is here. I'm going to remove this uh, guy, help me fire, because I don't uh, need it. Uh, we have already installed it. So if I do ls to k8, you see uh, the two files are available here. Let me show you in the VS Code as well. So let's do that. So this is the deployment and service ML. So what I'm going to do, simply I'm going to uh, use the command to convert this into a Helm chart. So uh, this is the command. So what we're going to do, uh, the name of the DIR uh, is gate, which is the directory. I'm going to export it, right? And simply I'm going to use this command, right? 
and what it does it will create the chart with this uh, name cloud geeks helm chart right so let's do that you see all the output is now uh, verbosity app enabled here so simply if i navigate to the section i want to show you that uh, you see this directory is created in this we have template our values and helm charts right so this is the values.tml chart templates and uh, you know this is our deployment and this is our service so guys uh, that is how you can uh, simply um, convert uh, all the ml files uh, into helm chart other th other than that if you have a single file like deployment you can simply get that particular command i mean get that particular uh, file and simply pipe into helmify uh, dash verbosity and it is going to simply create the helm chart that is it guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe the channel and have a nice day